Yep, play this in English. Let me, uh, should I move? I don't know where to put my face. Should I put my face like right here or up here? There? I don't know. Here? 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 I wish I had my green screen because I'll just put it right here. But my green screen is chilling in the corner. I just need better lighting for that thing, man. Once I get good lighting, that'd be dope. What to do, everybody? Man, it's too late here, and welcome to They Are Here. This is an alien abduction horror game uh, recommended to me by, yeah, yeah, you know, AK. So thank you, AK. Let's play this. They Are Here. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Gray's Woods Farm on the night of August 7th. The Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. The strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The children explained that someone was walking under the windows. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself? Or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Gray's Woods Farm to take a photo and make report for the local newspaper. Good English. Start. Okay. This looks like an actual video recording. It's kind of cool if it is. <laughs> I like that stock footage. Let's see. So we pull up. We pull up. He said, friend of mine asked if I believe in aliens. I never thought of it. All I know is that they better be chill like the ones in Mass Effect, right? Task. Talk to Farmer Peter Sherman. Sir, yes, sir. Ooh, okay. This is kind of smooth. So you could crouch. Can you sprint? Can't sprint, but you could crouch. All right. You could zoom in. I, I, I like what I see. What's that? Press the left mouse button to take a fix a photo. This is great material for a news report. Yeah. Okay. Three dots in the sky. Interesting. All right. Let's go to Sherman's house. Farmer Sherman. There's been some things going wrong. I don't know if you watch the news or what not, but uh, there's three floating dots in the sky. I think it's some alien phenomenon. What was that? I heard some clipping. Hey, what up, Zardy? How you doing, bro? Oh, that's my footsteps. They kind of thick. Farmer's note. Mr. Fox we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to the town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful. Peter Sherman. Interesting. Put it back. Inspect the house. All right. I like how this game looks. You'd be concerned yourself three dots like that, man. He said it's good stuff, though. It's good stuff. Hello, this is Doge. Oh, I hear voices out coming out of that. I don't like that. Peter Sherman. My name is, uh, I don't know what my name is, but I'm here. I'm a reporter, and I'm going to be here to help you. They are here. Mystery sky object seen here in Orano, Orano by Ed Methion. I'm sick. Those were the words used by John King, 23 of 92 Otis Street, when he walked into a banger police station and told the seeing of an unidentified flying object at which he fired four shots from a pistol. Why would you? What? Down to earth approach to alien visitors. This newspaper has information about UFOs and crop circles. These phenomena have been seen throughout the state for a long time. I never knew about this. Why have I never known about this? You see, uh, Mr. Dan, the reason why you don't know nothing about it is because you're not, uh, you're not working hard enough. But I know one thing, um, I would like to close this door. That's a nice pick. Why doesn't it close all the way? Oh, I don't like that it doesn't close all the way, bro. We got a fridge. Oh, look at your beautiful family. And the photo, members of the Sherman family. Okay. They went hiking. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, H-N-E-A-R. Just want to make sure, you know, uh, I'm getting everything. I'm a little concerned with the three dots in the sky. Like I said, Farmer Sherman. 
think it's uh, some alien phenomena. Phenomena. In the photo members of the Sherman family. Oh, yes. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Got some booze. Some scotch, actually. Yeah, some scotch. It's the dogo. It looked like it, it was a dog with a human arm, but then I look closer. Oh, there's light. Hello? Computer? Oh, he's searching aliens. Let me make sure I could go in both. Oh, this is the kids' room? That's, I guess that's her. A walkie? Apparently, it belonged to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Property of Negan. Oh, it's starting to sound creepy now. Farmer's note. This is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed. And the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Yeah, she probably was. That's a nice... A, a deer and an alien. It looks like the drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer. The paper is painted on both sides. Oh, she's... <gasps> the alien killed Doggo? Oh, you terrible alien, bro. Mel Gibson, where you at, bro? <gasps> Who closed the door? I ain't closed that door, bro. Uh-oh. I'm gonna need Mel Gibson real quick. Swing! Wait, what was it? S swing? Swing for the stars, Barry? Was, was that what she said? I can't remember. I just remember that part. Oh, they got pictures of aliens. So Frodo from the internet, perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. Ooh, look at that, bro. Ooh. I'm about to turn around and one of these things is going to pop right in my face. Nope. Ooh, yo. Ooh, yo. Yeah, okay, now he, he looks lost. He just looks like he lost. What's this? Found my own diary. How could I forget that? Saw the aliens. Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. He saw the aliens. So what was that? And very scared to go to sleep. He said, then one of them came over and did something to his head. He doesn't remember. Okay, so what? Who? What? What did they do to me? Yo, okay. Um, this is a children's diary. Found an old diary when I when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that diary text? Uh, da -da. Today was the most exciting series. They last the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. So the parents thought they were lying. The kid was lying, but obviously not. He was fishing from an abandoned pier in a river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around very low above the ground. A huge disc with four flashing lights and windows was hovering. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me in the air. Falcon punch! Are sure you can? I froze as if there was. As if you were in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright, and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on a pier later in that morning and barely made it home. My head was buzzing, and I walked home as if I was in a delirium. When did I get here? Or when I got here... I found several cuts in my body and two small, very smooth holes around my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. I, uh, I don't blame you. Take a picture of the diary. Oh, I, why did that randomly just pop up like that? Okay, cool. Nice. Yeah, this kid is definitely up to something. But this... Hold up. Yo, it's the aliens, bro. Oh, it's the aliens! Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm getting abducted! Oh, I'm getting abducted! Oh, not yet. I'm about to get a... I got a flashlight. Yo, this game kind of scary. Yo, this game kind of scary. Ooh! Oh, handprints? And pizza. Hey, bro, stop breathing like that. Stop breathing like that. It's gonna be okay, dude. I can lean with it, rock with it, lean with it, rock with it. Then I'm gonna crouch down, put a sock on me. Uh, okay. Uh. Oh, heck. Oh! 
What is that noise, bro? Oh, it. It was nice to know you. I'm gonna close the door. <laughs> what was that, bro? It's weird how horror games that scare us are the ones that are indie, right? He's breathing, bro. I can hear him. I don't even want to walk out my door, bro. Like, that's how scary this is right now. I heard him like... I got to go outside to see what that was, of course. So I can't sprint, so I'm not running away from it. Anything. Oh, the door's open, though. Alien. Beach the great alien. There you, my friend. Oh. Oh. The door opened by itself. Oh. I'm getting chills, bro. Look at that. I don't even want to watch it. Y'all think you're funny? Y'all for real think you're... Yo, they, they think that... These aliens are comedians, bro. There's a note. What does this say? As a child, headaches began to bother me. They tortured me to this day. I went to the doctor dozen... What's that noise? I went to the doctor dozen of times, but no one could explain the reason for their occurrence. Now I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple abduction. Oh, I remember the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was when that when the migraines began. The cuts that I noticed then behind the ear were a trace of them. I'm sure they've implanted something in me, some kind of transmitter or implant. Because of this, I forgot everything. I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Whoa, she took something out. It was a transmitter. A little jar with a strange device. In the note, Peter Sherman claims that he cut out an alien implant. Maybe take it? All right, I'll take it. Maybe I should have put it back. Oh, can I pick up that thing right? Ah! Yo, these floors be creaking. Yo, this game is creepy. Can I take a poop real quick? I'm out of the Papa Squad. Mm. All right, uh, I'm about to get abducted. Okay, aliens. They kind of do scare the freak. Oh, what the? Was it you, Scarecrow Jack? Oh no, there's five darts in the sky now. I try to focus, focus. Yeah, I'm focusing. Oh. Them aliens, all right. There's four. There was five. Yo. This is like signs, yo. Y'all ever seen signs? Whoa! Hey, what's up, dog? How you doing there? Tiptoeing on the marble floors. Run. Run. What we run into this way? Oh, we could finally run. You saw him moonwalking? My man's hit the, the moonwalk. Someone got abducted, bro. Oh, bro. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way. Oh, I got in the car. Okay. We're going, right? Turn on the... Hey, my dude. So much anxiety is going on right now. What is that? They fly... Hey, yo, that's a big ship. Ooh, that's the mothership. Look at that. Look at that. that that's the lights. They're, they're the lights. It, oh, bruh. Oh, maybe. Can we go? <laughs> can we go? It's time to go. Hey, can we go? 
Hey. Oh, bro. <laughs> Yo, he said, hey, can I introduce you to our Lord and Savior, the alien god? Okay, anyways, uh, demo. In the full game, you will find a large territory of Grey's Woods Farm and a full story of an alien abduction. Add the game to your wish list so you don't miss the discounted release. Yo, what? That was a good game here. I'll add it to I'll add it to my wish list, bro. I add that to my wish list. That was a good recommendation. This is actually on Steam, so if you guys want to check it out, there's a free demo right here. I got it off a of game jolt, but I did not know the demo was on Steam. That's fire, bro. Whoa. I actually, I was genuinely scared. I was genuinely scared. Whew. That was good. But yeah, running that outro. Good night, y'all. Peace, love, and all respect. Like that flame boy. Hey yo man's too lit. What's up? Like that flame boy. Yeah. Hey yo man's too lit. What's I was up? too lit, so I gotta spread this love, boy. Yeah. Hey yo man's too lit. What's up? Like that flame boy. Yeah. Hey yo man's too lit. What's I was up? too lit, so I gotta spread this love, boy.